not so Freudian here. Welcome back to Let's Play Magic Arena. Alright, so I did some like at work play. Haven't done any events because I'm you know trying to save my event money for streaming. But I did earn some boosters, so let's start with some opening. I miss having, like, interesting uncommons. Cleansing Nova. Okay, so another five mana wrath. Whatever. Mythic Rare Wildcard. Okay, so that's whatever Mythic I want it to be. I am going to assume that I can... that they all just are there and I'm not restricted to getting an M19 one. No, this is just like Alter's Re at Sorcery Speed instead of Instant. Takes two more... okay. That's awful. Alter's Reap might have been a common, but it's one man, one colorless, one black. Sack a creature, and you would draw two cards. So this is one extra card literally double the cost and sorcery speed instead of instant. Blurg. Oh, they reprinted Totally Lost with Fib Fib. He became a big meme, you know, like when that first came out. Lightning Mare. I remember Thunder Mare was the big creature in like the original portal starters. It was like 5-5, five, five, tapped all haste, and tapped all creature, enemy creatures when it came in. Or maybe it tapped all other creatures, not just opponents. Okay, so it's actually a Cheever clone. That's kind of cool. So I think clone was 4 mana. So target permanent with converted mana cost 1. That's an extremely strange... I mean... You can get rid of Alanoir Elves. What else costs one that you're going to bother with? And I guess if there's a, you know, color plus X enchantment or artifact or something. I don't know. I mean, in Legacy... I mean, you would still just want uh, swords to plowshares if uh, what's his bucket was still around. Death Rite. Okay, I like the new Guildgate art. Dream Eater. Flash Flying. Surveil Four. And bouncing on that permanent. Hmm. Eh, no worries, lit boy. Your company. Electromancers. Response and resurgence. Heals five damage target attacking a blocking creature. Control gain first strike and vigilance till end of turn. Oh, cool. That's. Is that the cheapest second attack step spell they've made so far? Huh. Alright, so home. I believe. Alright, I know I unlocked this today. I don't remember if I've played these two on camera, but I will do a game or two with this. There's a lot of make saplings, sacrifice saplings to make other things better. Sacrifice saplings is additional cost to play cards. Hey, thanks, lit boy. Feel good about doing them.
And like basically, I have the colors. He, he's going first, so I get an extra draw. So yeah, I got my third land. There we go. I always get him mixed up with the one that uh, like eats saplings. Like you can sacrifice any creature to get a bigger, or to make him bigger, but you gain life if he uh, sacrifices uh, a sapling. There is a... I'll either get one damage through or I'll have a 2-2. Two -two. Unless he, like, disperses it or... I forget which of the two mana, you know, bouncing all man permanent cards he has. What's the say? Oh. Alright. Poison departure. This needs six to be its best. Block one with him without losing anything, but then I can, yeah, get three through. I wish I had the like. There's a one mana instant that gives that makes me a sapperling and gives an enemy creature minus one minus one. So I can't kick it. But I can attack with both of them. And then I'll sacrifice one of the saprolings to kill the Jin if he blocks with the Jin. He's tapped out except for that, and I don't think he has giant growth available. And now he's not even going to kill my Thalid. Okay, I selected the wrong order. Okay. Target a creature. Sacrifice a creature. That would have been really annoying. What should you post on your channel? I don't know, what do you normally do? Okay, that doesn't matter, he's only here to kill stuff. Or to do damage when stuff dies. Sorry. You post memes? Hmm. I guess you could do, like, uh... Okay, so this should give me the city's blessing. Yeah. Um. You could do history of memes where you choose a meme and then you do a little presentation on where it came from, who made it up. Stuff like that. Okay. Now I can vicious offering that dude. Yeah, so here's the minus one, minus one thing I've been looking for. 
behind the meme. Oh, is that a channel already? Uh, okay, so let's see. It takes eight, so four, six, and then I can sacrifice a sapperling. I should just vicious offering the uh That's a hate. Just gotta out hate the haters, I guess. Okay, if I draw something with four or more, uh, what's the word? Or actually, two or more. Um, I'm not even gonna block, but yeah. With a two or higher converted mana cost. Oh. Six, seven. Right, so I'm just going to sacrifice one. Lose him. Oh crap, I could have sacrificed extra creatures. Just to kill him. Well. If I attack with them, he's got to block all of them, and he doesn't have enough things with enough toughness to survive. Yeah. Because his dudes die, my dude dies, and this dude does enough damage that he dies. Yeah, so I was about here earlier, then I won a game and dropped to here, and then I won another game and dropped to here, then I won a couple, lost a couple, and now you see where I am. It was just weird. Alright. Oh, wow, I didn't know you could get um, rares and mythics out of the, like, daily win things. Huh. Why does it look like an owl? They got a pack. Uh, Alright, so that's another pack to open. Two wild cards. That's interesting. Erratic Cyclops. Oh, you, he gets... Okay. Yeah, this would work well with, you know, making enormous bane fires or the, uh... Actually, if you kick a spell, does the kicker cost count toward the converted mana cost of the spell? I don't remember. I do not know what cookie clicker is. Yeah, what happens if you get four of a card? Will you keep getting copies? And also, why isn't there a... Like card checklist or something. You know, I have to come in here. Yeah, so like if I open a booster that would have a star crown stag in it. Do I just like does it become a wild card? Will I get a fifth one? And just, it would just, like, not be useful, so it's a waste of a spot in a booster? I have no idea. Well, I am curious. Gems? Alright, actually. Okay, if I buy packs... Packs are 200 each. You know? Packs used to... Like, 
before, I'm pretty sure that when I was looking at this before the closed beta ended, you got a discount when you would buy more packs. Okay, but that makes the math easier. Okay, gems, 200 per. You do get a discount on gems as you get more. So if you buy the max, you get a hundred packs, basically, for a hundred dollars. As compared to a little less than four for five dollars. Yeah, so basically if you spend a hundred bucks, you get a hundred packs. 750 gems for five bucks. Is 750 how many you need for a draft, actually? Yeah, five dollar drafts are actually a decent deal. Like, you know, if you're putting money into it. But anyway, I am actually going to do a draft with the gold I've earned. So I'm going to go ahead and start that up now. I'm probably going to draft and then do one game for now. Okay. Your upkeep. You draw a card for each land card. This isn't very good and constructed, but in a limited deck, it's not bad. That's... Weird. Eh, that's not a waste of oxygen. That's mostly good and constructed, but I kind of want it. That was reprinted, huh? Oh, hey. Yeah, remember in limited, you're looking for bombs, removal. I don't remember what the EAD are, but there's like a acronym for called BREAD. Like B R E A D. It was bomb removal something something something, I don't know. It's been a while. Another flyer. here, right? It's 
a weird, like, dinosaur alligator, but then, like, with newt eyes on the front. Dragon enters. It's not helpful, unfortunately. It's just mana fixing otherwise, huh? Pride mate is so good. You can draw and discard. Choose a color of that, that middle speaker. Yeah, that's true. White might be better than blue here, actually. I've only got two blue cards. Two mana, huh? Take the combat trick. Take the only thing that's not a land. Alright. Okay, I mean... Yeah, that actually works with what I've got. As does that. I don't think I have enchantments or equipments, do I? But that can put someone just way over. That can be useful. Sure. Take another Forsaken Sanctuary. Hired Blade. Drafting your final card, any cards that exceed your forex collection will increase your. What's a vault progress?
Okay, remove the forest. I don't have any green cards in here. Oh, wait. Okay, I was building that backward. I click here to remove what I don't want. Jeez. That's kind of annoying. Okay, so... 2, 10, 7... Okay. Six mana for a three, seven. Like, he's okay, but he doesn't have any sort of... Oh, the E in bread is evasion. Yeah, like, he doesn't fly, he doesn't have trample. I only need two of those. Four more. I guess one of them. Okay, let's see how this works. Play a game. Yep, no worries. There, little boy. Pastor Hugh. Interesting. Johnny's pride mate. That is a sorcery, okay. Why doesn't anyone else ever return to my streams? I honestly don't know. I just don't have enough of a character. Alright, hoping he attacks with the dinosaur. So I can drop this in. I'll lose one, he'll lose one, but his is better than mine. Oh no, he can kill my skeleton. this dude, but it's basically like I had a murder and murdered him with it. Okay. Walking corpse. 
Activate reassembling skeletons. No attackers. Yeah, hopefully. So I got like all of my cheap crappy creatures. Oh. Yeah, no, I don't have the mana for the I don't have the double white needed for this guy. Okay, what's the hourglass X2? It's normally just this hourglass X1. Alrighty. It would have been nice to get a murder. Oh, he has vigilance. Yeah, I mean, I can get two creatures and do six, eight damage to him, but that's not going to matter. Yeah, I didn't get any removal. Not a single thing. I'll do one more game because that was quick. Oh, Burst. I'm pretty sure I've played him before. That name sounds familiar. So I can drop the Pride Mate and the Neonate next turn, and then the Neonate can just start pumping the Pride Mate, assuming he doesn't remove it. Well, the next turn he can start pumping the Pride Mate. And the Chaplain can attack in and make him bigger. I remember, oh, he's mana screwed. Yeah, I remember using the, uh, like, declining, like when Primate was in standard back around Zendikar. I remember declining the plus one plus one counters because there was something that would do damage or something, I forget. Or that would destroy him if you were power four or higher. I 
think that exists here, but it's less... Maybe it was a planeswalker? Because, like, nobody ran... Or wait, or maybe people did run the Hey, Destroy creature with power four or higher or whatever because of the Eldrazi. I don't remember. Welcome back. Alright, so next turn I can Sovereign's Bite use that. He'll be a 7-7. Seven, seven. And... Yeah. That takes him to 10. He'll be at... That might be exactly lethal. Because 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah. Unless he drops a blocker, he's dead. Or he can remove my creatures. Either way. Guess you could cancel the spell. I think cancels. I don't remember what the because like, there's always a hey one plus blue plus blue. Here's a slightly better timeout used. Okay, so that's a timeout. How do you that you hit that? Maybe I have no idea. All right, sovereign's bite. Take action. Activate. Take action. I mean, he can block the skeleton and kill it, but that's not going to help much. And either of these other ones he blocks, it's not going to help either. Or, he's dead. But he can't kill either of these with no mana to pump. Yep. Now, next turn, if he doesn't get rid of the neonate, he's just dead. Oh, well, unless he gains life somehow. Which, you know, isn't inconceivable. Welcome, whoever else joined in on YouTube. Unfortunately, when this game's over, I need to go to sleep. So I work first thing in the morning. And this guy is just hanging out, letting his time run out. It's like, does he think I'm going to quit if he makes me wait? Is he just trying to piss me off? He has zero timeouts, so I wonder why the, there were two timeouts before. I've signed up for Discord. And I'm pretty sure it's on my phone, but I don't have, like, a Discord of my own. No. Alright. So, I do need to go to bed. So, I've gotten very little sleep the last several nights. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you would. I will see you guys next time.